so good morning everyone. Um, thank you for being here and to uh, going to present your papers uh, within this session um, unveiling invisibility, exploring knowledge, interdisciplinarity and identity through the histories of archaeological uh, collections. Uh, we have um, a very intense um, session today. Uh, we have uh, 13 papers. Um, they are um, all very different, but in, curiously, there is um, a question or a, a new word that is almost common uh, to all um, papers, which is searching for, searching for, uh, for lost, for lost objects, for lost results, and so on. And we have, we'll have um, papers on textual traces of lost objects, a paper on uh, lost res results from archaeological work, searching for including narratives, uh, scientific strategies, um, ancient Mesopotamia and collections and museums and so on, collections and nationalism, uh, collections, museums and individualities, silent and nosy and, and noisy, no, not nosy, noisy, <laughs> even if they can be also no, no, noisy, <laughs> nosy. Uh, uh, the collections, collections and interdisciplinarity, collections, conservation and restoration and gender identity, and um, last but not the less important, digitizing collections. So remembering uh, our session abstract, archaeological collections are invaluable sources <coughs> for reconstructing different aspects of the histories of archaeology the study of archival documents, publications and newspapers, articles related to the constitution and later evolution of such collections brings us insights into the development of archaeological theory and practice, the emergency of interdisciplinarity, as well as into the production and circulation of scientific knowledge across time. It also reveals the potential and role of archaeological collections in identity construction and in shaping various types of networks and power relationships within the discipline of archaeology. This session aims to unveil the invisible stories behind both pri private and public archaeological collections in Europe and behind, from the 19th century to, to the 21, 20th century. We welcome, of course, once more, uh, the papers uh, will be, which that will be presented during this um, session that will, for sure, explore such topics as have, as we have already uh, heard, agendas and ideologies behind collecting, researching and exhibiting archaeological <coughs> objects and collections, the scientific narratives built around collections, the contribution of collections to the devolution of archaeological interpretations and to fostering plurality and interdisciplinary Co collaborations and uh, investigative research. The roles of collections in the production, transfer and exchange of knowledge, as well as in building local, regional and national identities. So, once more, you are all very welcome to this uh, session. And in truth, we uh, must uh, remember that many things from many uh, reasons uh, were, were uh, silent, were kept, kept silent, and silence uh, is all, almost equivalent to death in the sense that we uh, don't know, of course, what is silent and why it was silent. 
So we hope uh, to break the many silences um, during our uh, sessions. And it is quite uh, interesting that uh, this kind of um, approach is already present uh, in other uh, research projects, research investigations. By the way, Alain Corbon, uh, he published uh, this book about the history of silence in the sense of things, theories, um, and uh, persons that were silenced uh, all, uh, throughout uh, the history. And uh, Hubert uh, Gerbeau uh, also published this other uh, book, very interesting and very updated, I may say, uh, monograph and uh, several um, mm -hmm. exhibitions, uh, mainly temporary exhibitions, also try to explore uh, the need uh, to unveil, unveil uh, many uh, stories like uh, this one. But of course, the archives sometimes are like this, and we have <coughs> to work with them and in them. And the same with uh, the museum uh, collections, uh, either private and public uh, museums and uh, collections. So um, let's begin with our session. Our session that, by the way, is organized by <coughs> the four names which are, that are uh, written there.